Hi folks, I'm Will Thomas, stretching teacher, and I want to teach you a quick eight minute stretching routine that you can use every day to get your back and your shoulders and your hips muscles moving a little bit to make you feel better. My stretching theory is that we get stronger and calmer just by looking for the tight places in the body, just looking for the stretch feelings. This is part of a longer class that I teach called the electric stretch. You can find us live on Zoom at stretchingteacher.com. So stand up, toes and heels touching each other. Bring your hands under your chin, knuckles touching your chin. Breathe in by your nose as you bring your elbows up. Lift your elbows so high that you find where your armpits are tight. And then exhale, head up. Elbows forward and touch, palms together. Push your knuckles into your chin until you find where your throat muscles are tight. And inhale, head down. Suck your stomach muscles all the way in and your pelvic floor all the way up and lift your elbows up. Find your armpits, find your rib cage. Wear those muscles tight and then exhale, head up. Elbows forward and touch, palms together. Push your knuckles into your chin. Find where your throat is tight with your elbows touching Point your elbows up to find where your shoulders are tight. And then inhale, head down. Suck your stomach muscles all the way in, pelvic floor all the way up. Lift your elbows up, find your armpits in your rib cage. And exhale, head up. Elbows forward and touch, palms together. Push your knuckles into your chin. Find where your throat is tight. With your elbows touching, find where your shoulder blades are tight. And that's enough. Arms down to the side. Arms over your head sideways. Palms together. Interlock your fingers. Release the index fingers. Thumbs crossed. Reach up until you find your armpits and your ribs. And then come down to your right side until you find especially your left armpit, left rib cage. Push your hips to the left. Find your left hip. Lean to your heels. Squeeze your arms and muscles. And then squeeze your arms and muscles tighter four times. One, two, three. Now forget about your arms muscles. Squeeze your abdominals muscles and then pulse them tighter. One, two, with your pelvic floor. Push your hips to the left. Lean into your heels. Squeeze your glutes muscles and pulse them. One, two, three, and four. Come back up. Stop in the middle. Reach up again. Find your armpits and your ribs and come down to your left. Find your right armpit, right rib cage. Right hip, lean into your heels. Squeeze your arms and pulse. One, armpit muscles. Chest muscles, abdominals. One, two, three, push your hips to the right. Find where your hip is tight on the outside of the right side. Squeeze your glutes and pulse. One, two, so you find out a little bit more out about your hips. Come back up, stop in the middle. Drop your head back until you find where your throat muscles are tight. Reach your arms back until you find where your chest muscles are tight. Push your hips forward. Find where the fronts of your hips are tight. And then lean back into your heels. Make all those feelings a little deeper. Squeeze your arms and muscles and pulse. One, two, three. Squeeze your abdominals and pulse. One, two, three. Hips forward again. Lean into your heels again. Squeeze your glutes and pulse. One, two, three. And four, come back up, stop in the middle, suck your stomach muscles into 100%, and then reach for your toes. On your way down, notice how close your fingers get to the floor before you stretch. And we're going to check this again after we stretch. Once you have your reading, bend your right knee forward and your left hip backward. Keep your stomach in the whole time, and bend your right knee forward and your left hip backward to find your left glute muscles. Give yourself a second here to let your brain go into a part of your body where it doesn't really hang out that much. Find your left side glutes and then switch. Bend your left knee forward and your right hip backward and find your right side glutes. Stomach in the whole time you do a forward bend like this. And find what's going on way back deep on your right side. And then re-bend your right knee so you're bending both of your knees and grab your legs from behind, elbows behind your legs on your calf muscles and pull, stretch your head down. Try to touch your face on your shins. Pull with your arms until you find your shoulders. Push your knees back until you find your hamstrings. Squeeze your arms and chest muscles and pulse them. One, two, 
three. Squeeze your abdominals and pulse them. One, two, three. Keep your grip. Push your knees back. Squeeze your thighs, muscles, and pulse. One, two. What do your hamstrings say about that? Suck your stomach in as you come back up. And hello again, everybody. Right foot, step to the right. Six inches apart, feet parallel to each other. Grab your thighs and sit down until your thighs muscles contract. Don't go so low that you're going to get tired doing this. Tilt your pelvis back until you find where your hips are tight. It's a twerk. Exaggerated. Reach your arms forward until you find where your shoulders are tight. Now, squeeze your arms muscles and pulse them. One, two, chest muscles. Squeeze your abdominals and pulse them. One, two, re-tilt your pelvis, lean back into your heels, squeeze your thighs and your glutes muscles. One, two, three, and four. Second part, stand up on your toes maximum and sit down on the tops of your toes. Again, just sit down to where your thighs contract. Not so low that you're gonna get tired. Tilt your pelvis back until you find where your hips are tight. Reach your arms forward until you find where your shoulders are tight. Squeeze your arms and pulse. One, two, armpits, triceps, biceps, abdominals. One, two, three, tilt your pelvis again. Squeeze your thighs and butt pulse. One, stand up taller if you need to so you don't get tired. Come back up. Third part, come up a little bit on your toes. Bring your knees together to touch and sit down just enough to where your thighs contract. If we go too low, we're gonna get tired, we're gonna forget all about the stretch feelings. And the stretch feelings are what are important here. Tilt your pelvis back, reach your arms forward, find your shoulders, squeeze your arms and armpits and pulse. One, two, three, squeeze your abdominals and pulse. One, with your pelvic floor. Three, tilt your pelvis again, squeeze your thighs and butt pulse. One, two, to find out more about your hips, Come back up, bring your right arm under your left arm, and pull your elbows in and down until you find your shoulders. Sit down until your thighs contract, lift your right leg up and over, and tilt your pelvis back again until you find your left glute muscles. Exaggerate it. Squeeze your arms and chest muscles and pulse. One, two, squeeze your abdominals and pulse. One, Two, with your pelvic floor. Tilt your pelvis again. Find your left glute. Squeeze your thighs and your glutes and pulse them. One, two, three, and four. Come back up. Bring your left arm under your right arm. And then use your arms to find your shoulders. Pull your elbows in and down. Find your shoulders. Sit down to where your thighs contract. Left leg up and over. And find your right side glutes. Tilt your pelvis back. Exaggerate until you find where your hips are uncomfortable. Squeeze and pulse your arms muscles. One, two, armpits, chest muscles, abdominals. One, two, three, retilt, squeeze your thighs and glutes. One, two, three, and four. Come back up and let's measure. Suck your stomach muscles in and reach for your toes. And notice how much you open the back of your body just by looking for where those muscles are tight. Suck your stomach muscles in as you come back up. Now let's do one big breath here. Suck your stomach muscles in and your pelvic floor up and start a breath down there. Bring that breath in through your nose, up through your stomach and your heart and your lungs and through your throat to the top of your head, to your brain. Hold it up there. Make your ribs and your breathing muscles expand out through your nose. Nice work, everybody. If this helps you, do it every day for a week and see what opens up. And then come see us at stretchingteacher.com and we teach an hour-long class every day. Please click like and subscribe and make a comment on this video and any questions, let us know. And thanks for joining us, folks. I'm Will Thomas, Stretching Teacher, Thank you for letting me show you this eight-minute daily stretching routine.